Hey guys, it's Russell Tussle, and welcome back for part four of our third playthrough of RimWorld. Uh, it's been a while, so I don't exactly remember what I was doing. Oh god, we have a lot of alpacas. Oh, and a prisoner. Hubbard. Okay, she's good at cooking and building stuff. So that's about it. Oh, she hates men and drugs and alcohol. Sounds like the life of the party. Hubbard? We are. Low food? Huh? I think that's enough food. Bambina is being attacked by a cobra. Of course. Of course. Thing is. God, do I let it die or. No, because then whoever it belongs to is going to be sad. <gasps> All right, I guess I don't have a choice. Just kidding. Lumi, where the hell are you? Oh, well, let me fast forward. That's what's going on. Shoot the crap out of that thing. Can we bury it? Nope, I don't think so. We're just gonna have to... Oh god, okay. I'm gonna temporarily get rid of corpses on this, so that... We can just take it over here and leave it? Because we can't eat, we can't eat the dog. Alright, nope, it's just going to be restricted. I don't know. I don't know what to do about that. There's just going to be a dead dog there. We'll, we'll have to build a, build a house around it. It's fine. There's another dead animal right there. A bunny? Okay. Oh, that's right, Linda was kidnapped. Also, Hubbard, why are you sleeping on the floor? Got it. That was a medical bed. Seriously, though, if you stop playing this game, like, I don't remember what the heck I was doing. Not enough steel. Whoa, what was that? What was happening? Here we go. Look at all the steel over there. <gasps> Did someone eat the dog? No, the cobra. Oh my gosh, I don't want to, I almost don't want to leave it there, but I'm too afraid they'll eat it. Slash, they totally probably will. Oh no. Oh, that's right, Linda died. <coughs> she was kidnapped and then she died, which is weird. 
that they know about it because you know once the pirates like radio us in hey hey linda died we kidnapped her from you a couple days ago and then didn't treat her infection so she passed away Seriously, what should I... Oh, we have a research table, finally. Let's research microelectronics, and then we'll research gun turrets. And we'll build those. Because hopefully that'll make defense a bit easier. Is she, like, pooping on the floor? What is this? Or is she just dirty? Meh, let's just release her. It'll increase our standing with the faction. Not enough to keep them from being hostile, but... Oh no. Okay, the rain put it out. Hate grass field for our alpacas. Because otherwise, I think they eat the potato crops. You know what, then? We're gonna rezone this. So that they cannot eat anything but the hay grass. Low on medicine. I'd say we're out of medicine. Minor break risk. I mean, that's just a way of life. Let's get, let's be real. What am I doing? So we need someone with a growing of eight to grow healer root. Okay. She's almost there, Aletta. fields down to. Her growing will level up just enough to plant more stuff. field. Mm, I guess we'll do it below this one. Let's do 9 by 11. That's the new size. is growing is zero. You should level it up though. Alright, what I think I'm gonna do is I'm going to get rid of grow, mine, and plant cutting for Lumi so she can focus more on research and crafting. Look at that. Didn't take long at all.
Oh, we let the prisoner go. See, look, it's like 86 instead of 96 now. So it looks like the convict party hates everyone. But these people are only enemies of the convict party as well. Alright, let's let's clean house, guys. Just kidding, everyone's going to bed. I guess we'll clean in the morning. Oh. Thought something was up. They're talking over breakfast before they clean the house. You know what? I could do it this way. And then we'll, we'll just prioritize research for Lumi. So she'll spend some time doing that. While well, the priorities remain the same for everyone else. Hmm, Bambina. Oh, a sculpture! Beauty for. It's almost not worth putting up. Here, we'll put it in the prison. <laughs> what is going on with you, Calhoun? She just can't get over Linda. And she's in pain. Because of a scratch scar? Oh look, Lumi, she she went and hit one ball and then went back to researching. So studious. Alright, what I think I want to do for the next expansion. If you have your stockpile indoors, the stuff decays less less quickly. So I think, so that's seven. I'm gonna seal off this the entire, like, L-shaped. Oh no, but then the coolers, can we, we'll have to move them. I wonder if you get 100% of the material back. I actually don't know. Cooler. Um, we'll put it, um, right in front of the heater, does that make sense? No, we'll put one right there. And then those can become doors. See, I know what I'm doing. Psh. Sock file. There it is. All 
Alright, now I'm a bit confused. I don't, I don't really know what's going on. Alright, there we go. Even at room temp, doesn't spoil for a couple of seasons. <gasps> beavers! A group of hungry beavers have just arrived. Try to eliminate them before they kill all the trees. Oh god. Alright. Let's go hunt the beavers. The good news is, I don't think the beavers fight back, and then you get lots of beaver leather. Ew. And lots of beaver meat. Yeah, I said it. I went there. Oh, it shows the research progress down there. I'm not paying attention. Is her research at least leveling up? Oh, so her research is pretty low. But it levels up faster. God, I forgot Lumi likes everything. <coughs> Mental break food binge. Alright. I mean, I'm okay with that. Better that than her killing people, right? her feel better, maybe? Oh, we had another wanderer join! Marina? She is a female villager. Oh, we made it. Oh god, I forgot that was the name. Shopkeeper Sheriff. She's incapable of dumb labor, skilled labor, caring, and being social. AKA, she can only kill people and do research. So, look at that. We're naming it. She's just gonna be strictly a hunter and a researcher. Okay. She she a nudist. She's upbeat. Okay. She hates prosthetics and she's a psychopath, which is why she can't care. She doesn't have a gun though. So who has a gun that probably shouldn't? Smith, do you have a gun? No. Didn't. <gasps> Linda had a gun, but Linda was kidnapped. Do we only have one gun? Oh, crap, guys. Alright, she'll have to go hunt things with her mace, I guess. There's so many beavers. to research. Eh, not that they will ever have time anyway. God, she's just shooting that one while it's asleep. Or correction, she's missing it. Well, maybe this is a good opportunity for her to get her shooting up. Look, it's already at 11. She'll be a sharpshooter yet. Let's 
start cooking some fine meals. Because that makes people happier too. How are we doing on the beavers? God, there's still a lot left. <coughs> Oh, she's Lumi's sister, Marina. Uh, Llama, how the hell did you get... Oh, alpaca five. We got another one. Are we still taming alpacas in the wild? I thought we got them all. Maybe that was the last one. God, this map is huge. What a... Oh, that was a cobra. Cobras are awful. Hunter lacks range weapon. Oh, Smith, why are you hunting? He's not. Why would it? Oh! Oh, it moves. Okay. She ain't hunting anyway. Maybe you can't hunt without a ranged weapon now. Before you used to be able to run out there and stab things until you could <laughs> and then eat them. She's getting better. What's she at now? Still at 11. Takes lots of XP at higher levels. Regular beaver meat, but alpha. Smith has gotten food poisoning. What? What's going on? The beaver meat is poisoning people? Or is it because it's not cold enough? Maybe we need two coolers. There's gonna be a wall of coolers. Lumi, you missed one. Oh. Lumi's the only one that can grab? not going to fly. We need some other people to craft stuff. We'll get better at it eventually. Nice. Alright, I really want... Machining. Okay, that's what we want to make guns. Craft gun, so we need smithing. Yay! I'm happy we figured that out. I couldn't find that before. Oh, Marina, have you been sleeping on the floor this whole time? Go, go to sleep. <laughs> That's your room now. Oh, that's my that's my bad. I feel like it's been a couple nights. Well guys, I think that's where I'm gonna end this episode. 
Uh, gosh, we're starting day 20. That's pretty impressive. I think this is, knock on wood, this is the farthest we've made it so far. So uh, once again, my name is Russell Tussle, and that was part four of our third playthrough of Grimworlds. Uh, please like and subscribe below, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye! Thanks for watching!